All right, now that I have both maps down pat, I changed the quality to 2048 by 2048. Sampling quality 4x4 for the Maya common output. And for the mental ray common output, I'm going to do 2048, 2048, number of samples 1. Now, I prefer 2, but it takes way too long. So Now, up above, just make sure that you know what these look like. So I have TIFF here. I'm choosing a TIFF because it had a hard time calculating a TGA or Targa. So I'm going to use TIFF for the OCC. It's going to be called Power Period OCC. This one's going to be called Power NM. Take out the alias. So make sure you know what these are called and where they're located at or you'll have a tough time with things. Okay, when I hit bake, this is going to take a while, so I'm going to cut the footage based upon how long it's going to take, and then I'll meet you back when the footage starts. Alright, after 14 minutes of transferring maps, um, we're going to look at the resolution of these maps. So I'm going to open these in Photoshop. So file open. Okay, and to figure out where they all went, here's my normal map. That one's probably pretty good. I'm going to check the timestamp here. And the timestamp over here does not correlate with the timestamp over here. Okay. Now this could be the, because the timestamp started at the very beginning of it. So I'm going to actually use this one, 5.52 a.m. Also, it probably used the normal map and calculated the normal map and that took a little longer. Alright, so this looks pretty good. I do get some high raised areas right here. I'm going to check this other normal map here. Same thing. Okay, so they're both the same. Good. Now, where did the OCC go, you ask? Well, let's find out. It was supposed to be located in <laughs> the power box, but it looks like it got A located to users, admin, desktop, power OCC. So, there it is. So, I'm going to copy that and move it back to where it needs to go in the power box. Also, I'm seeing a Powerbox TGA in here. So I'm looking for the TIFF here. So be careful when you're setting that project. That's what happens. Okay. I'm just going to sort this by name now so I can actually find the Powerbox and paste it in here. I'm going to make sure I open this in Photoshop to check it out. Good. So there is some cleanup involved. Not much, but there is some. I can see right here, this area. And this area might be nice to clean that up also. Same with the normal map. Alright, so in the next video we'll look at post-editing of these maps.